good morning everybody. We're going to be doing the lean out exercise today. But before we get started, let's do our warm up. And we're going to, so we're going to start with the good mornings. Arms are up, bend at the waist. We're doing these for 30 seconds. Breathe in, arms out, lean over at the waist. Breathe out as you're coming down, really stretch between those legs. We're just doing 30 seconds here. Keep the weight in your heels and keep your core tight, tucking your belly and tucking your butt. Okay? All right, so after those, now we're going to do the squat stretch. So squat and stretch. Squat and stretch. Knees down, knees bent. Go down as far as you can. Reach up with the arm. Point those toes. And breathe in. Breathe out as you come down. And again, just 30 seconds of these to warm up. Okay, one more. There we go. Okay. So now we're going to do the squat and twist. So we're going to squat down again, but this time we're going to come up. Our arms are going to stretch out. Our body and our head is going to go the same direction as our arms. We're going to breathe in and out. In and out. Again, 30 seconds. Keep your core tight. Weight in the heels. One more. There we go. Get that a little shake out. So now we're going to do 30 seconds of our butt kicking jacks. So again, feet out apart. You've got to kick back with your foot. You're going to raise your arms up. Okay? 30 seconds. Bend your knees. Keep your balance. Weight in the heels. in. Two more. There we go. All right, so just give that a shake out. Okay, so our first exercise is called the crab touch up. So we're going to get down on the floor. Okay, so let's get in position. You can lean back just on your hands, or you can go down to your arms, whatever you're more comfortable with. So I'll try it here on the arms, spread my fingers. I'm gonna put my feet shoulder width apart. And then we're gonna breathe in. We're gonna tighten that core, and then put your butt down. When we go up, we're gonna put our heels, tighten our core, put our butt down. So we're gonna do these for about 20 seconds. In the heels, suck your belly button in. Weight in the heels, suck your belly button in. Weight in the heels, suck your belly button in. Okay. Okay, so while we're down on the floor, we're gonna do the hip presses. So we're gonna lean back on our back. Okay, so we're gonna do these for two minutes. Okay, so we have the hip presses. So our feet flat on the floor. What we're gonna do is we're gonna really suck in our belly button, get our core tight, don't hold your breath. And then when you come up, you're gonna hold it for a second and you're gonna squeeze your knees together. And then you're gonna let it down and then relax. Take a deep breath and then we're gonna come up again. We're gonna make sure our core is tight, really suck in that belly button for three seconds squeeze the knees together, and then we're gonna let it down. Okay, so we're gonna do two minutes of those. You ready? And down. 
up, squeeze the knees, pull the core in tight, squeeze that belly button, and down. Relax, up again, up we go, squeeze the knees, really suck in that belly button, hold it for three seconds, and down. Relax, take a deep breath, up again, up we go, squeeze those knees, really suck in that core. Three seconds and down. Control your breath. One more time. We're going to go up. Squeeze those knees in. We're going to suck in that core. Really pull that belly button in as far as you can. Hold it for three seconds. And then we're going to go back down. And relax. Okay. Okay, so that was our first minute. We're going to do a second minute of those. You ready? So we're going to go up, push those knees together, really suck in that belly button, hold it for three seconds, and down. Again, we're going to squeeze in those knees, suck in the belly button, really squeeze those bum cheeks, hold it for three seconds, and let it down. Take a deep breath, hold it again up, squeeze in those knees, suck in that belly button, hold it for three seconds, and down. Okay, two more. Go up, squeeze those knees together, suck in the belly button, keep breathing, holding it for three seconds, and down. And one more. Then go up, squeeze in those knees, suck in that belly button, holding it for three seconds, and then we're going to release. There we go. Okay. So now we're going to get back up on our feet. So take your time doing that. Since we've been down on the floor, I don't need to get dizzy standing up. So just take your time. Roll out those shoulders. Shake out those arms. Shake out those legs. Take a deep breath. And we'll... Uh, into the next exercise. Okay, so next we're going to do the sidestep butt kicks. Doing those for 20 seconds. Ready? Here we go. Step to the side, and kick back. Step to the side, kick back. Step side, butt kicks. Okay, just keep your, your knees loose, just bend them just a little bit as you go down. seconds. Two more. There we go. Okay, so this one is called the triangle to warrior's pose. We're going to be doing it for two minutes. So we're going to break it down into two one minute intervals. So that's the warrior pose. We just turn our hips is all we do. We're going to go up with our arms. When we do, we straighten up her leg, and then we come down into warrior pose. So we're up in the triangle, down to warrior pose. Okay, and we're doing this for one minute. Really suck in that core, tighten those buns. Do this for one minute, take a break, and then do it for another minute. Really stretch those arms up high when you go into the triangle. Okay, we're going to switch sides. So we're going to come with this knee at 90 degrees, and this one's going to stay back. Arms out, and same thing. We're going to come up the triangle, straighten that knee, and then back down, bending the knee. Suck in the belly button. Under the butt. Keep breathing. Really stretch up those arms, reach them out. Bend that knee as you come down. Straighten it out. Bend the knee. Straighten it out. Bend the knee. Okay? So we'll switch back to the other side again.
straighten the knee as we come up, stretching those arms. Down, up, and down. Straighten the knee, bend the knee. Reach up with the arms, reach out with the arms. Keep breathing. One more on the other side. Bend that knee, 90 degrees, arms up and out. Up and out, up and out, up and out, up and out. Your arms should really be burning right now, I know what they are. One more, there we go. Okay, so give your arms a shake, give your legs a shake. We're gonna be doing our hip circles but only for 20 seconds just to loosen everything up so hands under your shoulders fingers are spread take a deep breath in tighten up that core so you're tucking in that belly button sucking it in and then we're going to go forward side and back to the side and forward okay Keep breathing. I'm only doing 20 seconds. I'm just going to do a few circles in this direction. Okay, then we're going to change direction. Go forward as much as you can to the side, back as far as you can to the side and forward. Okay, and just take your time. Okay, so while we're down here on the floor, we're going to finish off with the side leg lifts. I'm going to keep the, the leg on the floor bent. We're going to stretch out the other leg. I'm just going to raise them up and down. Up and down. Up and down. I want you to flex your foot, so kind of push out on the heel. Kind of point your toes or pull them towards you, if you will. And we're just going up and down with the leg as high as you can, just working those hips. Keep breathing it. Okay, so I'm going to switch sides. sides same thing we're going to lean on our side the side we're leaning on we're going to bend that leg the other leg is out straight and we're going to go up and down up and down up and down kind of point with that heel your foot is flat pulling those toes back towards you You just go up as far as you can. Okay. Keep breathing. Take your time. Enjoy these stretches. Loosening up those hips. We'll do one more. There we go. Okay. So get back up onto your feet. Take your time. That is it. We have done the lean out exercise and all we have left now is cool down. Okay, so as always, the cool down starts with around the world. So you wanna sweep down, keep your legs apart, sweep down, reach up, reach down, bending at the waist, hands out, hands facing towards you. And we're just giving their whole body just a twist all the way around. We're only doing these for 15 seconds. So we'll stop there, change directions. Really feel your body stretching sideways to the top and to the side, all the way around. There we go. Last one. And up we go. Okay. 
So now we're going to do our hip circles. So again, we're down on the floor. Hands are spread out, fingers are spread out. Hands on her shoulders. I'm going to stir it forward to the side and back. To the side and forward. Really take your time. Stretch where you feel needs to be stretched. We're only doing these for 15 seconds. Let me switch directions when we get to the top. Loosening up those shoulders. Loosening up those hips. deep breaths. Then we're going to take that right arm, we're going to reach that forward, and we're going to bring it in. We're going to take the other hand, reach all the way up, give it that extra little bit of stretch. We're going to come back, with deep breaths. There we go. Now really take your time getting to your feet. Give those shoulders a stretch. Shake them out. Shake out your legs, your wrists. Kind of move your neck around a little bit. And that's it. That was our lean out exercise. So we'll see you back next time.